I am wrong. Okay, this is why we bring reinforcements, children, for when we do stupid stuff. trick-or-treaters welcome to another episode of Spookorama where we talk about spooky things all year round I am your host Cromwell Witch and today we've got an unboxing unbagging un enveloping we're opening mail recently I made a purchase really gotta stop making purchases really if I want to go out into the world and travel and do fun exciting spooky things I gotta stop buying spooky stuff for my house will that happen Probably not, but I need to. All right, so I have had my eye on a particular item for quite a while. Um, but I'm very much, I'm a bargain babe. I don't like to pay full price for anything because half the time you really don't need to. Um, but I'm also like a complete cheapskate. Uh, and I'm like, okay, if it costs more than $4, it's out of my price range. But I was extravagant. Confound it. Why did I do this? Because I'm really excited. Um, there is a particular item I've had my eye on for quite a while on Society6. I've never actually bought anything from Society6 before, um, but you guys, have pro you guys are probably familiar with it. It is a platform where artists can upload their artwork and basically it'll get printed on t-shirts, tote bags, mugs, blankets, comforters, curtains, just about anything you can imagine, you can get that design on it. Um, so that's a really good way for... Um, artists to find people to buy their art and the artist gets a commission out of it which is partially why some of the stuff is a little out of my personal price range um, because they get a commission and so that's great so you know that when you're buying something it's not just going to the company which of course I'm sure a lot of it is going to the company because that's just always how the stuff works but the artist is actually getting a commission for that um, so without further ado let's get into I made one order and both of them were the same print or same design or whatever but they chose to send it separately for reasons I don't quite understand. But um, like this came beginning of the week, end of last week, and this only came today. So I, I don't know why they didn't just stick them together and save on shipping. But they didn't. Um, they, ooh, hold on. Let, okay. So before we get into it, because I don't want to botch this, so I brought reinforcements. Um, the... Design comes from, on Instagram, uh, it is the Chicks 9114 um, that's Kaylee Hicks. She has, like, the cutest stuff, and her artwork goes to fancy places, and, like, she's done stuff for Disney. Anyway, um, on Instagram, which I will link down below, and I will also link the, the, her shop on Society6, um, it's the Chicks 914, 914, whatever you want to call it, um, and she has, like, the cutest stuff. It's all very vintage by, oh, I don't even need scissors. It's all very vintage, uh, got a vintage vibe to it, and it's really, really cute. Actually, no, you know what? We're not going to open it first. We're going to open the big one first! Mainly because it's the same design, so once you see it on the tiny one, you won't be, you won't be as impressed. I really hope I like this, because, like I said, I've had my eye on it for quite a while. I think it's the absolute, oh, I'm glad I didn't have my scissors. I think it's absolutely, oh my god, the cutest print. And, oh my god, 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 holy poop. Oh, dude, dude, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, cats are freaking out, so I'm freaking out. Guys, are you seeing this? Look at this. Ah, okay, so it's the Headless Horseman, and I, you guys know I love the Headless Horseman so much. Um, oh my god. So this is the Headless Horseman design. Oh my god, I'm sorry. Um, so you've got the Headless Horseman with a pumpkin head and tombstones and little trees and oh my gosh. It's so cute. Oh my god, guys, 
and it's so soft. This is my cape now. My cat's like, what is happening? Hello. Oh well. Um, oh my gosh, guys, this is, I've never taken this blanket off. From now on, my videos will just be like, oh hello, welcome to Spookorama. Have you seen my new blanket? Isn't it divine? Guys, guys. Oh, and it's like really well printed. Like, I never really, you don't really know what you're gonna get, but like the color is so rich. Oh, this is amazing. Um, actually, what inspired me to finally break down and buy this throw, um, it's a throw, if you couldn't tell. It's a fleecy throw blanket. I got it in the small size. They have three different sizes. I would ideally like the huge one because it's massive, but uh, that is like crazy expensive. And I already was like, I can't believe you're paying this much for a throw blanket when you have 18 million throw blankets. But look at that. Oh my god. Oh, this is so cute. Um, but actually the day I bought this, all of their throw blankets were 20% off. And also, they um, had free shipping. So, you got two coupons that you could actually use, two coupons. Um, so, I mean, it, the universe, the Halloween, the Halloween spirits were telling me this was the time to buy. <laughs> um, I love it. Oh my gosh, if I wasn't already wearing a velvety dress, I would keep this on, but it's really, really hot. <laughs> But nevertheless, we'll keep it on. And then in my tiny little envelope, my little baby envelope, we'll open. Yes, thank you. Oh, it's a little. I got a sticker, which I'll have to show you back here because you know if I get close, it goes, oh, I can't see anything. Um, I got a little sticker for my laptop. Just because, I mean, look at this design, guys. It makes me so happy. Um, and if you check out her shop on Society6 or just even her Instagram, she has so many really cute designs and a lot of Halloween ones. I know we're all on the Halloween here. So she has a lot of Halloween designs, but also Christmas and just all, all kinds of stuff, but a lot of Halloween. Um, and they're all so cute. Look at that. Oh, my gosh. Okay, I'm thrilled. Overall review of everything, I'm thrilled to death. This is adorable. I am going to take this and go snuggle up and watch something spooky. I would say I was going to go watch Sleepy Hollow, but I just watched that like two days ago. So maybe I'll wait. But oh my gosh. Maybe I'll get to take it with me when I go to Sleepy Hollow one day. Maybe, maybe the Headless Horseman will be like, that is such a cool blanket, dude! Because, you know, Hessian Horseman know the word dude. Um, that's a pretty decent size. It was, I really would have liked a bigger one, but I was already pushing the limits of my checkbook. So, am I your grandma? My checkbook. Good God, how old am I? Literally the only person I've ever heard say checkbook is my grandmother. Oh my God. I've got to find some young friend somewhere. If you're young and know the cool hip slang of the day, and are looking for an elderly friend to teach or just hang out with, please leave me a message down below, because obviously I'm in need of help. <laughs> I haven't left my house since 1998. But now with this blanket, I won't want to. Alright guys, so thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed uh, this video. If you did, I'd appreciate a like, uh, the little thumbs up thingy. That'd be swell. Um, if you want to see more weird videos, uh, please subscribe if you would like to. I'd love to have you around. Part of the Spookorama family. I think that'd be really swell. Um, and as always, please leave me a comment down below. I love hearing from you guys. I love knowing who's watching this stuff. And what did you guys think? Do you like this? Are you going to go grab you a fancy blanket? Because, oh my gosh, I'm in love. Okay. <sighs> no! Oh, that's a miracle. I thought maybe my lipstick got on it and I would cry. I would cry tears of sadness. All right, guys, I'm gonna go curl up and watch something spooky. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day and until next time, happy trick-or-treating.